guys, let's go over my pride, my, um, fidget collection. Okay, so this is a, a rainbow pride van. Uh, I bought it at my like, dock in the pride section, but you can't, but it might not still be there. But yeah, it's only there during pride months. I just use it as a fidget because it's kind of satisfying. This is some kind of pride squishy. I got the, this was like free because I got it at like the swag stand at the pride festival. Um, yeah, it was for this company, something about eating disorders, I don't know. It's 3D printed snake. Technically, it's not a fidget, but it's really calming to me for some reason. So I just kind of put it in my sensory or just my sensory headphones. I got them from Amazon for, I think, $50. I mean, yeah, 50 not 15 I can't talk. This is my grape-scented boba slime. Um... It's like grape scented, but I was biting my nails after using it, and it tasted like hand sanitizer, so that kind of sucks. But I got this at five dollars and a dollar general out it when I was on vacation in Montevideo. Uh, they used to have like a bunch of foam add-ins, but they don't anymore because I took them out because I didn't like the texture. Probably shouldn't have felt that, but yeah, yeah. This is my spacing poppet. There was this staff, and I had, I when I was ten, I had to go. I was having some kind of meltdown. I had to go in her office, and uh, I told her I asked her if I could just borrow this for the day and then return it. But I was kind of a malicious little child, and I never did. So now I just have it, and I tell a lot of people I bought it myself. Uh, Miss Nora, I'm sorry, I was just kind of in a silly, goofy mood. I'm a little quirky at night, except I don't really get that excuse because it wasn't night. It was like the middle of the day, like 12 o'clock. <laughs> sorry, Miss Nora. I might have stolen your space puppet. And this is some kind of plushie, this like ice cream cat plushie that I call it Clone Cat. I got it at the Pride Festival for $20 when it was. And, um, it was, I, it's technically also not a fidget, but it's a sensory thing for me. I like squishing it and stuff. Pink Llama Stretch Ball, probably one of my favorites. Uh, it's just really satisfying. My mom was deep cleaning my room because we really lost the remote. I have a TV and we lost the remote. So she deep cleaned my room and found this and gave it to me and now I'm obsessed with it. This was about, I think, two or three days ago. This is glue. Yep, glue. I use glue as a fidget. By that I mean I put it on like my skin and then wait for it to dry and peel it off. My mom got me this clear glue so it doesn't like get everywhere and stuff. I just call these kind of strings or whatever. These are probably also one of my favorites. They're like really cool. I, I got these at a pride festival but you can also just get them on Amazon. They just happen to be selling these at a pride festival for $15. Uh, they're pretty satisfying and I really like them. I think... They were intended to be bisexual colors, probably, but I don't really know. It was at this autism stand, something about autism. Pretty cool that they had that. This is like my mini car poppet. This is probably one of my cheapest fidgets, uh, but I, I really like it. I think it's really cute, and I, I like poppets. And I have this fan. You can probably find it on places like Amazon, Etsy, and Timu. But I got this for like $15 at a Pride Festival. I don't know, they were just selling this and my dad, and I really wanted it, and, my, and it was pretty cheap, so my dad let me get it. I bought this at the same place where I got that, uh, strings fidgets at that little office stand. Uh, you can also, same situation though, you can probably buy it online or at other stores. It's just that I, I, I bought this at a Pride Festival. It was about $10. This is my purple mini slug. It came in like a package of a bunch of mini slugs. I think they're like really cute. I got this, I got all of the mini slugs on Amazon. So you see a mini slug, I got it on Amazon. This was on my birthday and I used them as party favors, but we bought like three boxes. So it would last. So everybody would get one and I'd get a whole box. Uh, My friends are mad at me over that, but they, but they can't. I, I don't really care. <laughs> this, I don't even remember where I got this. Because I've had this since I was five. All I, I, I just, it just, the price tag just recently came off. It was like a sticker. 
and uh yeah it was like I th it was like eight dollars i mean i said that wrong. it was like three dollars but i don't really know where i got it uh you just kind of try it the challenge it's just kind of this challenging thing where you're trying to move the smiley face around this is my pink butter slime i got it at like a mall in a kiosk it's getting kind of stiff um, I, I was gonna, I was planning on reactivating it. Not that stiff, I was just planning on reactivating it before it gets too stiff, but it's pretty stiff. It's like this butter slime I got it for like $10. Uh, it's still kind of satisfying, I just prefer it when it wasn't so stiff, so I'm gonna fix that. It used to have these charm, it used to have this watermelon charm, but I kind of lost it at school. Yes, my teachers let me bring slime to school. Not like noisy slime though. They don't let me bring any other things. This is the cloud slime. I I my mom got me this on Amazon for there was like three other ones. They were all from Amazon. They're like it's like this mini cloud slime. My mom got me it just to be nice. It wasn't for any special event so I was like, no. I'm honestly obsessed how it looks when it stretches. Don't don't tell me don't tell me no. Okay, I know what it looks like. Shut up. I don't even know what you call this, but I'm, like, obsessed with this. I just kind of call it a water tube, honestly. I got this at the mall for, like, $15. Uh, it was in, like, this kind of toy store. Um, it's one of the things that people don't like about it that I sort of do is how slippery it is. Like, like, watch this. I like, can't, like, grip onto it. It's kind of funny. Extra slugs after the birthday party. And these were like my pink kind of mini slugs. They are not all the same kind of pink, but they're all pink and I like that. It's cute. I don't really like pink that much. My favorite color is black. My other favorite color is white. Sorry, I'm, I'm boring. And I have these two mini slugs, the blue and the green ones. Still not my favorite color, but I really like them. My favorite color is black because I'm goth. My favorite color is white because... I'm autistic and I just like the way it looks. <laughs> this is my S'mores Prasheen stress ball. Uh, it, I really like it. I got it at Claire's. It was like $10. It's like a blind kind of packaging. It's like a blind box, but I, I really like it. The noises it makes. It's just kind of dirty and the paint's coming off. That's probably because I got it like six months ago. And this is my first paper squishy. Uh, it's like a trolley box. Oh, crap. Crap, crap, crap. I think I might have just put a hole in it, but I'll fix that in the morning. Uh, yeah, I just kind of made it, like, this evening. I like poking it up like that. I'm gonna go fix that real quick, guys. Be <laughs> okay, I fixed it. Emergency surgery, sort of. But yeah, there was, like, a little hole in it. Honestly, I don't like squeezing it. I like doing this. The noises it makes are really satisfying. I recommend making one. I might make a tutorial on how to do that because it's pretty simple once you get the hang of it. Oh, edit. That was not a trolley one. I, I had a trolley one. I got confused. That's that, that was a Chips Ahoy bag. <laughs> that was a Chips Ahoy. Honestly, I don't really like Chips Ahoy that much though. Like, I, I only eat, like normal cookies for some reason. I'm just weird. This is the trolley one. It's upside down. But yeah, let's hope it doesn't like make a hole but if it does i have tape right here just in case i like this one a little better probably because i like trolleys a lot better because they're my favorite candy actually fun fact about hole emergency surgery okay that was getting kind of annoying i only have two of these so far i'm gonna probably make another one later tonight or something i don't know i get like bored this is my poppet journal i don't i, I journal it so I can't really show you the inside, because that's kind of personal stuff. But yeah, this is, the, I, I really like it, because it has the little poppers. Just ASMR for you guys. I don't know what that stuff on it is, though. I'll probably wash that off. Uh, this is this butter slime, it's like in a pack. Uh, you can't really see the toppings very well because they all kind of went inside of the slime because this slime's really sticky. But here's one of like the big charms. It's like a peach one. I put I had to put the toppings in. It's like this peach seamed slime, cherry butter slime. Um, 
I really like its texture. It has like this kind of hard, crunchy texture. It's pretty nice. I like the noises when I squeeze it. I just want my cupcake coffee into this one. I don't really know why I put it. I could have put in a better color, but you know, I like it. Also, these are my glitter tattoos, by the way. Uh, yeah, I usually like this one. The texture is pretty nice, and it smells good. They're all scented, by the way. This is my lemon seeds butter slime. It's scented, like lemons, but it the scent is kind of weird, but I still like it. Doesn't smell exactly like lemons, but you know, that big lemon charm fruit. Yeah, and I just lost it, but you know what? <laughs> God. I don't even need to open it because I already recognized this one. This is the iconic rainbow slime. It's like white, but it has rainbow charms. It's when it came, it was like a little stiffer than the other ones, but I really like it because like the white color mixed with the texture just, I don't know, just makes it a lot more satisfying to squeeze and stuff. Can you guess what it is? No, it is not the crap seam slime. What is wrong with you? Okay, a lot of you probably guess chocolate, but, but I just know in my heart that that the boys, that the white guys watching this with sixth grade humor probably assume that. But no, it, it's it's freaking chocolate. <laughs> but I, I, I'm trying to find the charm that always gets like sunken in here. Just a second. No lie. I thought this was a chocolate scene. One. It is the popsicle seat. It's like a pop- What? Why don't- Why would I choose that one? For- they, What? What? I don't even know what- That doesn't even make sense. I put the popsicle- Okay. I accidentally- I, I think I ruined my life. See, the brown should be chocolate themed. I had chocolate cupcake charms. Put a popsicle in it. Okay, I'm weird. I really assumed that would be the chocolate themed one. I, I don't really remember. This was all- I got this all on my birthday. My birthday was like June 10th, so yeah. This is my sort of underwater mermaid themed butter slime. Honestly, one of my favorites because the texture is so squishy and I love it. Uh, yeah, this one is probably one of my favorites. Can you guys guess what this slime is? I can't really remember what it is, seriously. This probably should have been the peach one, but you know what? That was that one other color also works. Oh, it's the watermelon one. That, that actually works pretty well. I can kind of tell why I put that there. I really like the texture of this one. It's just a little hard, but I like it. Shut up. Don't you dare. For those of you who you don't, don't you dare, don't you dare say that. For those of you who don't get it, uh, we're not explaining it to you. Good. You, you don't, you don't, you're, you're too young. Oh, God. I also kind of have, um... This one, but I can't remember which seam this was. Let me just. Yep, it's the unicorn one. Nobody probably gets that. It's unicorn themed. I, I don't know. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I, I didn't expect it to be unicorn themed. This is my candy seed butter slime. I honestly love the texture so much. It's like a perfect texture. And the scent is perfect. So yeah, this one is probably one of my favorites. This is my uh, ice cream seamed. This is my ice cream seamed um, butter slime. The texture is pretty nice, but the scent is kind of weird. I don't really like the scent too much, but the texture is pretty nice. Honestly, the scent smells like doo-doo. I should have put this in the red or the pink, but this is my strawberry seed butter slime. I am obsessed with this strawberry charm. It looks so cute. At first I thought it was a carrot, honestly. Though. But then I realized how short it is and realized it was a strawberry. But yep, I, I love the face. It's really cute. And the texture's really nice. And the scent is pretty good. This is my lemon cloud slime. I really like this one. The texture is really nice. And oh my god, look at that little lemon charm. It was the stretch. It's like so cool. And also the scent is like really nice. So this is, can you guess what scene this is? You probably guessed like blueberries or something. But actually, 
just start covering this. It is stitch seamed. The other one's kind of hard to see though, but yeah. Honestly, smells kind of like nail polish, which, which sucks, but the texture is so good. I really like this. And I love stitch. As a matter of fact, I actually have a stitch plush. Okay, I know this wasn't in the picture drawer, but like, I love it so much. Therefore, I had to show you guys. Uh, this is my kind of um seashell themed one. The charm's kind of buried in there. It smells kind of like doo doo, but the texture's really good. But it smells like doo doo. I hate my life. Yeah, the texture's good. I, I, it might be a good slime, but it doesn't smell like doo doo. That's why I just don't smell it. Then it's a good slime until I smell it. <laughs> and I bet you guys can't guess what it is. It's a giant sensory slug. I got this at a kiosk in a mall for like seven dollars. On Amazon, it's like a lot more expensive. But I really like this one. This is like my probably my favorite. I just didn't trim ASMR.